Liverpool versus everybody. Um, how's everybody doing this morning? We're coming with a late video. Um, we didn't get to watch the game live uh, in real time, so we had it recorded. So I just want to come the next day with some thoughts, especially after you know, being yet again depressed. Um, just couldn't get the mind together anyway, and it, you know it was going to be super late, and so uh, whatever. Figured I'd, we'd just come today and do something. Um, so. First of all, hats off to Southampton. I think they dominated two legs of football against us and, and were obviously, clearly, um, the team that deserved to go on. Um, some some would, would disagree with that. I think Klopp does. Um, and based on the performances, we could have gotten goals, uh, but we didn't. We didn't get them. Um, and that's kind of been, unfortunately, the, the, the same old story uh, throughout the season, really, even games that we've won, um, chance after chance after chance that we, we just can't capitalize on. Um, at least that's how I see it from my point of view. So, um, yeah, Southampton deserved it. And um, what a lovely song they sang at the end about going to Wembley. Um, and, you know, just listening to that, it really hurt. Um, because it is a game that you, you should get a better result from, um, especially with the chances that you have. Uh, I will say that it's unfortunate, and I think all teams have gone through this throughout this season, in the league, uh, in the cup, what, what have you. Um, and some things are out of our control that go against us. But that's football. And I hate to, you know, make excuses about that. Um, it does hurt. It, it is frustrating to see um, really blatant things that that go against us, and in big games, and, and things that could change the game um, in our favor. There'll be games that that will have that too, and and you know, then we can't complain. You know what I mean? So things happen. Uh, you got to pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and um, you know, fight. And I think the, the performance was again a good enough today, um, and you know. People think that's crazy because we didn't score. Um, and that's the thing, you know, so I said going into it, I wanted to see a good performance. There were times there where, it, you know, it was really frustrating, um, you know, passes uh, to the other team and things of that nature. Klopp brought up the wind, uh, the, the weather or whatever. I, I don't know. I'm not there. I don't know. But you, you, you'd hope this, is a, this would have been a game that we can come out and get that win, you know, and I just thought, uh, we, we would have done that. I really did. And uh, as the time went on, you know, you, you give Southampton enough time and, and they actually took their last chance. And that's all they needed and that sent them through. So, um, a tough one. It's obviously a tough one. It's it's obviously one that really, 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 really hurts. And um, it's it's highly disappointing. And it, it's amazing to me that people keep bringing up um, Sadio Mane. Um, you know, let's remember that most of you when we got Sadio Mane, um, you know, people are wondering why we were paying this much for him. What is he really going to do? Is he really that good? Oh my God, another Southampton player? No. Now everybody's crying about it. You know, and it is what it is. He's he's he has dedication um, to to the Afghan, to his to his country, um, and you know that's it is what it is. You know what I mean? Um, he offers something really, really special for our team that we haven't had in a long time. Excuse the noise in the background, but you know that's that's just what it is. We got to just keep going with it. And, um, you know, we, we, we got to be able to play better, uh, no matter who we have on that field or who we don't have. We got enough players in this team. There's enough players out there on that field to get a better result yesterday. Um, and so you're kidding yourself to think that, that that's not good. That's not what it was. You know, you're kidding yourself to think that, oh, without money, we, we can't. Oh, this is what, no. We can win games. We should be winning games without money. Um, and if not, that's that's really sad. That's really sad if we can't. Um, it's looking like we can't so we, because we haven't been able to do that without him. Um, I don't believe it to be true, though. We're in a really, really rough patch right now, and it's got to change. It's got to change with the next game. This is how it's got to be with Wolves. So, when we play, we need to get a victory. Uh, we need to get some confidence back in the squad uh, and, and, and continue to fight uh, this season. There's still more things to, to get. There's still more goals to reach um, and meet. So I believe we'll do that. Uh, we're not going to support another team, are we? So what we need to do is continue to get behind the team. Um, for me, it's not a data to just pinpoint one player or, or a couple players. As a team, we just didn't get it done. And that, 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 was, that, that showed so brightly. Um, Matt Tip on his first game, starting again in a while, a little rusty. I think that's probably, um, you know, natural for him to be a bit rusty. 
Um, and, and then just, just, just the back four in general just didn't really do so well today. Um, Southampton yet again had chances to put that game away really early, and thanks to Carriers, they didn't. So um, it, it's, it's rough. It's tough. Um, you, you, you wonder about signings and, and, and how we can improve this team uh, in, in the meantime. Uh, you know, and, and, and again, it's, it's just makes me really sad that we're putting our hopes in one guy and, and him being the reason why we can't we can't get these points. So, um, you know, I think the crowd again was, was a little weak. Um, maybe maybe more improved from Swansea, I guess. But I heard a lot of Southampton fans. Um, I mean, they traveled deep. You know, and, and that's what I heard mostly. You know, Saints marching in and all the other songs. It's almost like we run out of songs to sing and, or something, which is totally ridiculous. I know it's not true. So at the end of the day, the guys have got to play. You know, that, that you can't make an excuse about the fans. Um, it hurts to see that, but the, the guys on the pitch got to go out there and play football. And, and um, we went out there and played, but we, we didn't we didn't do enough to get the result. So. Um, Enjoy the rest of your week, Redmen. Um, this one's a hard one to swallow, but let's just bounce back and um, try to get a victory this Saturday. Till then.